there, YouTubers! Welcome to Mr. Meatballs Takes on Life. As usual, I'm Jonathan Brett, a.k.a. Mr. Meatballs. And I'm Peter Corkin, a.k.a. Life. That's right, Peter. Mm. So, since we're celebrating a health couple of weeks, we wanted to take the time today to talk to you all about a condition that affects one out of every 3,000 to 5,000 people. Marfan Syndrome. I have Marfan Syndrome. Marfan Syndrome is a genetic disorder that is inherited at birth. People with Marfan Syndrome tend to be nearsighted, to have a short skinny torso, long thin fingers, flat feet, and a high hard palate in their mouth. So the Disney villain Jafar probably may have had Marfan Syndrome, huh? I wouldn't doubt it actually, he's got most of the symptoms. Hmm. But the two places that Marfan Syndrome affects that could possibly be life-threatening are your skeletal system and your heart. People with Marfan syndrome tend to have something called pectus excavatum, which basically means hollow chest syndrome. I have that. I've had three surgeries in my life to try to fix this. I haven't been successful yet, but I'm not giving up hope yet. Because of this, it crushes my lungs and the right ventricle of my heart. My blood pressure is not as high as a normal human being should be. Talk about a not so fun dip. Not at all. People with Marfan syndrome tend to have very, very weak heart walls. So if I get enough blunt force trauma to my chest, my heart could possibly rupture and kill me. Pretty scary, huh? That's really scary. So uh, is there any way to maybe fix this, to heal it? Sadly, there is no cure for Marfan syndrome, nor is there any therapy to make it better. It requires extensive monitoring of the condition, and if worse comes to worse, valve replacement surgery. Marfan syndrome is kind of scary, and, and you know, unfortunately not so many people know about it, but we're really glad that we could take the time to teach you all, because Marfan syndrome, while kind of scarce, it definitely is a very real problem that affects the United States. And there are a lot of famous people who actually do, or have, had Marfan syndrome. Abraham Lincoln is rumored to have had Marfan syndrome, Joey Ramone from the Ramones <laughs> had Marfan syndrome, and Jonathan Larson, the guy who created the Pulitzer Prize winning musical, Rent. But here's the good news. Due to the many advances in the medical field, the life expectancy for someone with Marfan syndrome has now been greatly extended. Well guys, I hope you've enjoyed this lesson about Marfan syndrome. And, you know, go about and find someone who has it and see them a little differently now. Just know that everyone is unique and special in their own way. The best you can do for someone in this situation is to support them and be there for you. When I had my surgeries, he was there. You gotta be. I mean, that's what friends are for, right? Exactly. But anyways, that's all the time we have for Mr. Meatball's Takes on Life. Again, I'm Jonathan Brett. And I'm Peter Corrigan. Bye, guys! See ya!